process plans have excited scores of Ghanaian musicians and music listeners as well who have taken to social media to share their thoughts on it. Well, in the video shared on his Insta story, Rick Ross expressed his desire to work on a project in Africa, specifically with African artists, including Stone Boy. We want to do a project in Africa with African artists. And not just African artists. Let them know, Brett. We want to incorporate artists from where? Don, Stone Boy. Stone Boy. Uh, uh, Yemi. Uh, uh, Diamond Platinum. Uh, Chaco. We got you all. We're going to do it in 12. How many How many songs you want on the album? 12. Let's 12, do 12. 12 so countries. let's incorporate 12 different countries. 12 countries. 12 different artists. 12, um, 12 different lead artists. And then we're going to have three or four artists it featured in the song in each of the videos it's going to be the biggest thing in africa and guess who's leading it ricky rose this is the new we are the world so producers boom. artists get boom. Ready. this is going to be huge there you go boom. that's a beautiful one you know what i'm saying i'd love to hear a stone boy of a cross record that's going to sound like it's going to be good well let's come back now kofi Jama. Uh, has opened up as well. Uh, Ghanaian rapper Kofi Jama has left fans intrigued in a cryptic message shared on social media platform X. Now, the Costa hit maker opened up about his extended hiatus from releasing new music, attributing the absence to personal struggles that have uh, kept him away for over a year and a half. Uh, in a heartfelt post, he candidly revealed, I haven't dropped music in almost a year and a half. I'm going through a lot that nobody knows. But I guess it's I'm so used to being nobody. The mass tweet has sparked concern among fans and followers, leading to speculations about the rapper's well being and the future of his music career. Well, I hope we can reach out to that brother, and uh, he's probably going through a lot. story for you afro beat superstar joseph akim from what donors or popularly known as joe boy has taken a significant stride in his yeah. five-year career by signing a dual deal Bison. with global music inside warner music the home of superstars like uh ed sheeran carter b burn boy the dual deal sees joe boy launch his own entertainment outfit outfit called young legend as well as being one of music's latest flagship artists out of africa well, this move sees joe boy exit empower after five years where he released two eps and body, soul, and spirit. Two albums somewhere between beauty and magic and body and soul. Yeah. So Joe Boy has exited Empower now. 